Johannes says it will not forgive only key. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Ohane's Indibu Worldwide has warned that it will not forgive River State Governor Nyesen Wiki if he does not back down on a boy state governor, David Umahi Travels. In a statement issued on Sunday by Secretary General Omazi Okechuku Isi Guzuru, the group decried what they described as the constant negative comment of Mwike saying they could wreck his political career. Ohanese comment followed its disagreement with Wiki's recent verbal assault against Governor Basaki of Edo State. It also insinuated that Wiki was somehow involved in the recent judicial troubles of Omahi but provided no proof for the allegation. Omahi was recently sacked by an Abuja High Court which has been has since appealed the decision while an Eboy High Court ordered the government ordered the governor to stay put. He claimed he claimed that there is a grand scheme and conspiracy to remove the Umahi, describing it as subversive and provocative invasion aimed at distracting the Southeast from the 2023 presidential election. The verbal diary of Governor Nyesen Wiki of River State in all national issues is worrisome, and that will likely wreck his political career to a disastrous end. Any governor who is instrumental to displacing the fellow governor will be assessed by Nigerians at the end of 2023. How can anyone derive happiness from other people's agonies and tragedies? Uh-uh. Oh, Anese, what is going on? No, that means you're siding one person. Oh, Anese, you're not a party. I don't think... See, this has got nothing to do with him becoming the presidency. Sincerely. Who is, I mean, his presidential ambition. This thing happening to Umai, they're not saying he should not contest. They're saying... He should leave the seat. If APC wants to give Omahi the presidential ticket, fine and good. He should be given the presidential ticket. It is, ah, uh -uh. Abi. <laughs> he does not stop them from giving him the presidential ticket. In my own opinion, of, of course, please, I stand to be corrected because, you know, I'm sincerely apolitical. Governor Dave Omahi cross carpeted from or defected from the PDP to the APC in 2020. He did not defect in 2019 before the election he defected after winning the elections in the under the plea defeat platform now I, I don't even need to be a politician to to look at this logic a group of people supported you gave you the support and you voted somebody you know you vote there and you want something let's say they helped you achieve an aim and then they did it for you the first time they did it for you for this the second time then you now left them. You left them. You did not even wait to even invest, just as um, they have invested in you, you, you know, repay it because I know politics is business and business is politics. Okay? You did not even wait to invest and say, okay, let me even give back these people or let me hand over. Let my tenure end. You jumped in from, you jumped from wherever you're coming from. You are seeing the bigger picture. You are not seeing the consequences of your action. And then you jumped into the APC. And these people, they looked at you. And they were like, oh, everybody has the right to go. And these people, they were looking at you. They're saying, okay, it is when it is now time for 23 election that it got back at you. Now, yes, um, uh, this time around, they're not even saying don't become the, the president. They're not saying your party should not. They're saying you should hand over. So I don't see did this Ohanese stand me. I don't I don't understand it. I don't understand it at all. If Ohanese is saying this, that means Ohanese is actually backing Dave Omahi. And please, this is it is they are going to create problem for themselves. Are you seeing the problem they're creating for themselves? Because there are people actually under PDP that wants to become the president as well. There are presidential hopefuls in the PDP and in other parties as well. They won't tell me that oh because APC is not the only party that the East the South East has. In fact. There are few Southeasterners in the APC, so I don't understand where this is coming from. So you want to tell me that, oh, he's only Dave Omahe now. Is that what they're trying to say? Because I'm trying so hard to get the picture, but you know clear. You <laughs> know clear, and I know Zemi, I know smoke. I'm not hiring anything. Maybe I'm, I'm, I'm not the only one that it is not clear to. This talk is not, is not right. 
You should rather ask how can an elected governor transfer the people's mandate under a political party to another party that did not win election. Sincerely, these Oaneze people, they are beginning to show that they are two-faced too. Anyway, it's for the Southeasterners. What is this man even talking about? Court sacks someone for defecting without any just cause and you're calling Wiki. I don't know. I don't know. Not that I'm vouching for Wiki. Wiki is on. Uh, you know, he has his own. But, mm -mm. No. Now, anybody coming for Wiki without asking what Wiki did, sincerely, I think the person should go and find out. Before Wiki comes out to add, but Wiki is not, yes, there are sometimes he overdoes, he oversays some things, but that does not as well mean that he just comes and, you know, he's just the one. Why does Wiki have the power to sack, you know? Does Wiki have the power to remove the sitting, sitting governor? No. So, what exactly are you saying? Something must have led to something. And you go to the root cause of a matter. Not, you don't go and um, cause of the middle in a bit to get the solution. You're not going to get a solution like that. Okay. Wiki is doing what every politician would do by supporting his party. Exactly. He's trying to fight for his party. He's standing up for his party. Just as those politicians do now. They stand up for their party come what may. Okay. Oaneze should go and sit down. This is a free world. Uma is a betrayer and deserves all he's getting from the PDP. Uma he deserves what had befallen him as a length out of experience. That will serve as a deterrent and a corrective measure to others of the same species. Because me, I don't understand. He came out, people were coming out to say eh, the party was in crisis when he defected. And I'm saying so, the party being in crisis now meant you should go with your mandate. You went with your mandate. And now the APC is like, okay, you know, since you are there, then somebody else should come and sit. No, now it can't happen. So they want to tell me that that there were people that voted for PDP. Now they voted for PDP. Now they are what? Eh? I understand that is a mixture of personality and party. But this time around, have you ever seen uh, somebody coming out to say, oh, I want to come out for president, and the person comes out without a political party? We don't we don't practice such system of government here. The party system of government will practice, which means you cannot stand alone. You have to stand, you have to stand with a party, identify with a party before I make you even hear you out. That is how it has been.